lovelies, welcome back to my channel and thank you guys so much for tuning in to All Things Desk. Today we are going to be slaying this Jerry Curly unit available at iMinks.com. It's in our luxury wig collection. All of our wigs come pre-customized and ready for you to install. So I'm going to be showing you guys from start to finish how to install this unit and how to make her look very, very natural. The curls on this unit is, they're very, very beautiful. They're thick, they're luscious, and I love how it gives you that natural hair vibe it doesn't look too much even though the hair is very full it looks very natural and so i'm going to be taking all these steps so that i can get a seamless install and i'm not even going to put baby hairs on this unit you guys are going to see just how flawless this unit is she is hd lace 250 percent density and she's also 30 inches there are other lengths that she comes in but all the units are 250 percent density so she will be full just like the one i'm showing you in today's video if you guys are interested in seeing how i styled her or just some little short videos i have featured this unit on instagram at iminx underscore llc i've also featured her on tiktok at iminx underscore llc and yes you guys i'm just getting into it getting this unit on and we are going to talk about this install so for those of you that still struggle with putting your wigs on you want to make sure that your wig is flat in the front area um, the hair is human hair so you can uh, straighten it you can flat iron it and it won't burn but you want to make sure it's not too hot because yet again it is hair it, it is hair so you don't want to get the hot comb too hot um, so I'm just going to basically prep my um, my forehead and the surrounding areas where the lace will lay. You want to make sure that you are putting alcohol on that area because if you are using glue or any adhesive, you don't want the oils from your scalp or your, you know, from your face to peep through. That will turn the glue white and it will make it harder for the unit to stay down. So you want to make sure that it's completely dry. You can do ball cap method if you want to, but I chose not to do ball cap method. I just pretty much placed my cap on my head and I applied the unit. So when you are parting, um, that seems to be the hardest part for some people. You want to make sure that you are parting around your ears so that you can have a seamless install and that the, you can, you know, put your hair behind your ear and the lace looks appropriate. It doesn't look like it's over your ear, under your ear, or anything like that. So you want to make sure you are being very careful when you are cutting the lace. In other videos, I have showed you guys how to achieve this you know uh, parting around your ear and what to do so i'm not going to really explain that my main purpose i just want to tell you show you guys and also talk to you guys about how to slay your units and how to get that scalp effect so after i do this you guys are going to see me pretty much play with the hairline play with the placement and then we're going to get our glue onto our um, skin and you want to make sure you're doing light layers you want to make sure that you are smoothing all of the glue out so that it can dry and there's no residue you want to make sure that the glue is completely clear completely clear because you do not want it to be white and then it's going to be all cakey and it's not going to look right so i'm going to just show you guys this process and then after i come back with the install i want to show you guys how i pretty much make the hairline look realistic Okay guys, so in this last portion, we're gonna cut the lace. And as you guys can see, I'm doing like a zigzag motion. I like to lift the lace up just a tad bit so that I'm, cu I'm cutting close to the hairline, but not 
onto the hairs and I do this so that it could look very realistic and there's not much lace to be shown but the lace that is showing we are going to fix that we're going to add some fit me powder and then an adhesive um, to it so that it can pretty much blend in with my skin color and this method helps to blend the lace literally like nothing else um, you can use a, a lace tint but this works just as similar as a lace tint so this is my little method that I do um, to basically get that to melt into my skin and as you guys can see it's looking just like scalp you cannot see the white residue anymore and I love everything about how she came out and so I was going on vacation this day so I didn't really um, take my time to like, you know, go through the whole entire wig and comb it. But I did um, add a lot of water. I didn't add any conditioner this day, I don't believe. But I did add some um, water and some eco style gel. And that was really good. Um, it held very nicely. The curls looked rejuvenated. And when it dried, it was so pretty and luscious and the curls were defined. I will be showing you guys some clips of how the hair looked. Um, the hair does dry um, pretty decent. It takes a, not, not too long for it to dry. It actually dries kind of fast. Um, but when it dries, it looks very pretty when it sets. So you get that same big look, but you almost get like, you know, that refreshed curl. And that's what I love about this unit. A lot of people think that this is my real hair when I put this unit on uh, because it looks so very realistic. So um, as you see here, I'm just going to wet the wig and we're just going to play with it. I do like to use my detangling brush so that I can really define the curls. And as you guys can see, that curl pattern is popping out and it just makes it very, very pretty. The unit is not heavy at all. Literally, you guys, she's so light. Um, when you are putting all the water on it, you know, it can't make it weigh a little bit. But that's because it's big hair. And who doesn't love big hair? So I'm going to be showing you guys some close-up. This is how she looks in the back. And we're going to get to Slaying. We're going to be going on a trip. So yes, you guys, get into it. If you guys are interested in this unit, visit us at iamix.com. Also, uh, we have different lengths. She's only a 250% density, so she will be very full. So if you're in the big hair, you will love this unit, like I mentioned before. So yes, that's it for today's video, you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. And we will be back with more videos. And we will be showing you guys more content on how to slay your wigs. We will see you guys next week. Bye.